This video was made exclusively for instructional and educational purposes only. The PayMaya official apps served as the inspiration for the making of this film. All credit and rights belong to their respective owners. No copyright violations are intended. First thing you need to do is to download the PayMaya apps to Google Play Store if you're using Android phone, or in App Store if you're using iOS or Apple. Once you downloaded the PayMaya apps the next you have to do is click to PayMaya icon to open it and to start the procedure. If you have already a PayMaya account, you can go directly to click the login button and start the virtual card activation procedure. But if you are a new user of PayMaya, what you need to do is to create new account so that you can log in and start the procedure. Now it's time to open your Maya app to check if your account got upgraded. After opening your Maya account, click this profile icon and you will navigate to your profile page. Here you will find your account as upgraded. Now it's time to activate your virtual card. Click the back button to return to main page. Then scroll to left to find the cards option and click to cards button to show the virtual card option. Click to the virtual card now to go to the next step. Then you will navigate to online payment card number page. The card number that they will provide will enable you to shop online without a credit card. Make sure to have at least 100 pesos in your PayMaya wallet to start using this card. To activate your virtual card, click the activate button now. Congratulations! You successfully activated your virtual card now. To show your card number click the view card button now. Now you can start using this virtual card to purchase online powered by Visa. Here you will find the virtual card number, expiry date, and CVV details and your name that you are going to use while purchasing online. Please do not share this card details to anyone to avoid others from using your card and protect your balance amount. To make it easy for you, I made a step-by-step -step video tutorial on how to edit or resize the scanned copy of your passport and passport size photo that will accept by the EPS online registration system, using laptop and mobile phone application. I made a step-by-step -step video tutorial as well on how to pay your EPS topic test registration online. Make sure to watch this video tutorial so that you will have an idea on how you will become successful in online EPS registration process. Please like, subscribe, and share this video tutorial to your personal friends, family, and Facebook friends, so that we can give them a chance to work in South Korea with minimum salary of 80,000 pesos per month. You heard it right, 80,000 pesos.